Greetings programs, Neo Mega Man back again for episode 80. Yeah, the big triple header heading your way. And in the first matchup, oh boy, check this out. We've got John and Felicia going up against Dragon Death Scythe. Oh baby. And this is a match to get excited about for because, ladies and gentlemen, Felicia has recently gotten an upgrade and now she and John are on par with the fearsome Gundam team. Oh man. This match is going to get a little intense, so forgive me if my commentary is a little faulty. But, uh,. Let's light this candle and kick off episode 80 in the right way. Dragon Gundam getting his stiff together. Here goes Death Side. John and Felicia looking good. Round one, here we go. All right, Felicia gets things started, and John jumps in with a couple of kicks to help her out. Felicia tosses Death Side away. Ooh, big jumping slam on Dragon from uh, John Talbain there. Big badass combo there. Felicia calls in a little bit, uh, a little helper there. Another big spinning slam on Death Side. Dragon Gundam sitting back there charging the special meter. He better get in there and save Death Side, or else he's going to get his butt kicked. Oh, big flamethrower on Felicia. John trying to save her, but unfortunately he can't get interrupted out of that throw. Big spinning throw on Dragon Gunner from John there. Uh-oh. Looks like, oh man, the arm special. Does a buttload of hits, but not that much damage. Oh, Deathside tacking on a little bit of a hit there at the end. Again, oh man, Felicia gets caught by another flamethrower. Oh, John with a big uppercut, or a uppercut kick catching uh, Deathside out of the air. Felicia's helper gets interrupted by Dragon's, uh, Dragon Gunner's uh, special animation. Oh man, it's the big flame wall and fire fire flags. Match pretty even so far. Oh man, Felicia gets hit by another uh, flame throw. Oh man, John going bonkers and doing a buttload of damage to Death Side in the corner. Felicia again. Oh, big spinning throw. That's that's a good amount of damage on Death Side. Looks like Death Side's going for something big here. Oh man, big ninja combo on his part. Doing a buttload of damage to both John and Felicia. Oh, Gunners are pinned in the corner, and that's enough to take out Death Side. Dragon's in severe trouble now, left against both John and upgraded Felicia. Big spear shot there, does a buttload of damage to John. Another special going off here. Oh, he gets the arm special, but it, uh, Felicia knocks him right out of it. Felicia summons another little helper here. Oh, man, uh, John gets hit by the special stealer. Oh, man, John gets down in the corner, but... Oh, now it's down to Death Side and Felicia, or uh, Dragon and Felicia. Oh, man, the big uh, spinning baton special from uh, Dragon Gun. And he's pinning her in the air with uh, multiple of spear shots and rapid kicks. Felicia got to do something or else she's going to get pinned in the corner to her death. Oh, big jump kick special there. And the other one's enough to take him down. Holy crap, dude. Felicia, the last, well, woman standing in round one. Unbelievable. Round two, here we go. Oh, man, Dragon gets things started with a big spear shot to a, uppercut, or to a jumping kick special there. Felicia summons another helper. Looks like uh, Dragon and Deathside had John pinned between their attacks for a minute there. Oh, big flamethrower does some pretty good damage to John Talbain there. It looks like Felicia got caught, got caught by a little of it. Oh, big flamethrower knocks Felicia out of the air. Dragon and Death, Dragon and Deathside had him pinned between their attacks for a minute there. Oh, big flame dragon does some pretty good damage to, Dra to De uh, Deathside Gundam. Felicia summons another helper. John, oh man, gets knocked back by a Dragon De or Dragon Gundam's big uh, special there. Oh man, the drill, oh, the drill special that does a buttload of damage. Oh, it's almost enough to take Dra uh, John out of the fight. Deathside again doing some pretty decent damage here. Knocks Felicia in the corner. Oh, Dragon Gun getting in the end of a big fireball. Gets caught by a... Uh, oh, man. Now the, the Darkstalkers have him pinned in the corner. Oh, big oh, big uh, slam there. Oh, looks like the bullets from uh, Death Side were enough to knock John out of the fight. Here goes Dragon Gun. He's got uh, Felicia with the spin special again. Oh, that drill spear is just gnarly. Big fireball does a buttload of damage. Does she have it in her to take out both the other Gunnams by herself? I don't know. Rapid spear shots doing some more damage. Death Side teleporting around playing mind games. Saves uh, Dragon Gun from a little bit of damage there. Again, Dragon Gunner just sort of charging, not really doing a whole hell of a lot in the corner. He better get in there and save uh, Deathside, or else he's going to get kicked, or else he's taken out. Oh, big flamethrower special hits Felicia in the middle of the ring. Oh, Deathside combos right out of right into the flamethrower, and that's enough to take Felicia out. Unbelievable! This fight's going on round three. I told you this upgrade was gnarly. Here we go. All right, the Gunners get in there and start things off. Big, uh, oh man, the big spear drill special hits both John and Felicia to start with. That's going to give Dragon and Deathside the edge in the beginning. Big uh, chain throws there, right into the flamethrower throw on John Talbot. You know, a buttload of damage to him. Felicia had uh, Dragon Gun up in the corner there for a minute. Gets tossed away for trouble, though, unfortunately. Now Dragon Deathside had uh, Talbot pinned between their attacks. Talbot coming back with a big uh, nunchuck combo. Ooh, Felicia gets thrown out of the air. Big backflip kick on uh, Deathside in the corner. Uh oh. Dragon Gun going uh, EX mode. He's going to do a buttload more damage that way. Combo and John in the air like mad. Big drill kick downwards. Oh, man, and Talbain gets taken out by the aerial throw. Felicia trying to fight her way out of it, but unfortunately the Gundams are just fighting too hard. 
And Dragon Gundam's EX mode gives them the victory. Holy crap, Ola. <sighs> God damn it, I can. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The new Darkstalkers, man. They are badass. Unfortunately, they just didn't quite have enough gas to keep up with Dragon Gundam's unbelievable arsenal of moves. And they drop a, a rare loss here now. Very rare. 2-1 to Dragon Gundam. To Dragon Death Side, I mean. Oh, man. The fight was so good. I got myself backwards here. I gotta take a break. Be sure to stay tuned. Part 2 will be coming your way rather shortly. And welcome back. To part two of episode 80. Yeah, baby, here we go. Pikachu on his way to another victory, and this is the end of the line. If Nightmare cannot pull at least a one round victory out of his ass here, he is gone. Eliminated. This battle will be taking place on the TK Hall of Fame stage. I don't know, I thought it was appropriate. Anyway, let's light this candle and see what shakes loose. Kirby and Kratos there in the background. Pikachu is ready. Nightmare's ready. Round one, here we go. All right, Nightmare jumps in, but unfortunately he can't uh, get land a hit on the rat as Pikachu's just a little too fast. Pikachu, again, now just thunder-shocking and drill-tackling his way to a an early lead here. Oh, combos right into a Thunderbolt. Look at that damage. Another thunder-shock knocks Nightmare away. Nightmare trying to get on the defensive, but he can't block forever. Misses the Sparta kick there on Pikachu, who combos right into another Thunderbolt for a flawless victory in round one. Holy crap, dude. Nightmare just got rolled on. Unbelievable. Pikachu with a flawless victory. Round two. Let's see if he can do it again. All right. Nightmare looked like he was going for something there, but unfortunately he missed the rat. Pikachu. Oh, man. Nightmare barely blocks the Thunderbolt that time. He got lucky. Oh, man. Pikachu not getting a double flawless in this one. Nightmare landed the Sparta kick, and now he's trying to block everything Pikachu throws at him. Unfortunately, he's not going to be able to keep that up forever. Pikachu jumps out of the way of that Sparta kick. Goes right back to his offense. Thunder shocking. Oh, man, Nightmare drops his guard at the wrong time and gets hit by the Thunderbolt. Pikachu with another Thunderbolt. Nightmare manages to block that one. Pikachu missed a little punch action there. Oh, man. Another Thunderbolt, but Nightmare blocks that one in midair. Again, he can't manage to pull any offense out. And he can't block enough damage to stop the Thunderbolt from dropping him in round two. Unbelievable. Pikachu just pulled off a one-hit 2-0 over Nightmare. I mean, he's gotten some pretty damn good victories before, but that one, that takes the cake. And speaking of taking things, Nightmare, collect your things, clean out your locker, because, brother, in the words of Mr. McMahon, you're fired! Oh, brother. Well, that's all for Nightmare, folks. Sorry if you liked him, but uh, he just was not getting anything done on my show. Pikachu with another big victory here in his first ever elimination. Oh, baby. That's it for part two. Stay tuned, because uh, main event, you're not going to want to miss. <laughs> I guarantee it. That's it for now. Stay tuned. Part three coming right up. And welcome back to the main event. And looky, looky who we got here. It's Kim and EG. Yeah. Back from training after a fairly heartbreaking and unsuccessful run over on TK's roster, they're here to rock some socks off. And I mean all the freaking way off, okay? Their first unfortunate draw is Kazuya and Kuma, Team Tekken. Like all good main events, this throwdown will be happening on the World Warrior Arena stage, so uh, kick back, relax, and enjoy the fight, man. This is going to be good. It's good. Good! Kim and EG stretching out. Kazuya and Kuma ready. Round one. Let's rock. All right. EG gets things started with a kick there. And then uh, EG knocks both Kuma and Kazuya out of the air. Oh, big flaming flip kick. Does a buttload of damage to Kazuya. Uh, Kim getting knocked down by uh, Kuma there. Oh, man. Another big flaming flip kick. Does a buttload of damage to Kazuya. Oh, man. Kim just body slammed the bear. And then not to be done, to, outdone by his partner. EG manages an aerial slam on the bear. Big uh, Another flaming phoenix kick there. Does a buttload of damage to Kazuya who gets thrown right into the corner. Oh, big throw kick and knee on uh, Kazuya there. Oh, big... Man, just Kim just body slamming the crap out of everybody. Pins uh, Kazuya and Akuma to his, or in the corner to his death, and now it's left to Kuma and Kim and Eiji both. All, Kazuya, all Kuma can do is block. Oh, big uh, special combo there. Big flaming flip kick right into Eiji's uh, aerial kick. Good teamwork there. Oh, man, they're just pinning Kuma between their attacks. He manages to roll away for a second there. Uh-oh. And the big ninja cape slash special is enough to take the bear down in round one. Holy crap, Ola. 
Yes, ma'am. Kim and Eiji looking rather impressive. Round two, let's see if they can do it again. Oh, man, big laser slash right into one of Kim's big special starts off in round two. Big aerial throw on Kazuya. Oh, big laser slash to Kuma in the corner. Again, Kim and Eiji just sort of pairing off. No big deal. Oh, big melee special on... Uh, Oh, Jesus, right into, Kim, right into Kim's big backflip kick. EG misses another special there. Big flaming kick knocks Kazuya to the ground. Kuma getting his butt kicked. Another big super special there. I think that's enough to take Kuma out. Yes, it is. Now Kazuya left all to his own. Oh, man. Kim misses the uh, end of the big backflip kick combo there. Oh, big corner kick combo on uh, EG. But unfortunately, Kazuya pinned in the corner. And body slam to his demise right on top of his bear buddy. Yosh. And Kim and Eiji, folks, there you have it. Big, nasty 2-0 victory for their their debut match. And holy crap. Yeah, you can bet that that's going to be pretty much standard fare for their matches. Kim and Eiji, man, they are not to be trifled with. They did a lot of training in the offseason. Had a good long time to do it, too. You know, big, uh, I'd say at least three, four, maybe five months break since they left TK's roster. And uh, now they're here to stay, and they are going to be a major, major threat in my show's doubles roster. Whew. Well, that episode was packed chock full of dynamite, wasn't it? God, three big fights tonight. I hope you all enjoyed the matches. Please, please like the episode, drop a comment, and if you aren't already, please subscribe to my channel. It, it's only going to get better from here, folks. I got big plans. This marks the march towards the last episodes of the season. Yeah, starting with episode 81 and moving on, these will be the last matches. So these are probably going to be the last matches you'll see from these teams this year. I say probably because you never know. But yeah, so uh, anyway, that's it for episode 80. Hope you all enjoyed. As for me, I am Neo Mega Man, signing off. End of line.